What's up dudes and dudettes of the internet, my name's Seth and today we're going to be taking a look at the Candy Barbarian and his gem. Candy Barbarian has gotten some serious tweaks over the past couple weeks uh, with Mantle of Power coming out and in all honesty he's actually not bad. I mean he already wasn't as bad as most people think, but I mean look at this, we're in U6 and I do not have that much optimal gear and we're tanking like a biowethesis. <laughs> I speak English good. But yeah, like seriously, he's actually handling it no problem. His number one ability is actually a lot of fun rather than being viable, where you just press number one, it pulls enemies in, and then he does a grand slam down on them. And it's just Tramapoline! Tramapoline! <laughs> It's so fun, like seriously, it's a fantastically awesome ability, and although it's not that much stronger than the initial, like his normal number one, I mean, it's not like anybody ever used his number one offensively anyways, because it's not very, like, it's not a very good skill. Because like you're far it's much better to just do like your right click attack uh, And even right now like as you can see we took out like took that enemy to a quarter health And let's try the exact same attack or the number one on this enemy and you can see right there Like it doesn't actually cause that much damage But the fact of the matter is that it's spewing out candy seemingly every single time So I think that might be the point of it. Let me actually read the description Sugar crash now leaps straight up and crashes down vacuuming enemies towards you and applying a brief snare so it's more a little bit of crowd control rather than being an offensive ability Oh, this dungeon always sucks. You can never find the boss. There he is. Thank goodness. But yeah, it still is a great ability, and I would definitely recommend, like, if you're going to end up maining the Candy Barbarian, you definitely can at this point. However, it's not like, oh, and I was going to say that too. I mean, besides that insane lag we just got, uh, but this ability is very, very weird because, yeah, as you saw right there, like, if you, especially if you're in Skylands, you're going to end up falling off of the edge, like, really really easily and that's not something that I particularly like his candy crush ultimate looks like there was two bosses here that explains why it was so difficult but his ultimate has actually gotten the biggest buff of them all and has like some insane damage on it Like seriously, I would recommend using that one more for crowd control than his number one However, the fact that his number one is actually a usable skill now and Fun is like yeah, I I, I just think that that's so cool Plus it's very very pretty like look look at when it actually works <laughs> okay, well anyway, it's so cool man cuz seriously, how could you not love Hulk smash like it's great man So if you want to main the candy barbarian, you definitely can D Can yeah, that's a bad pun, but either way He's still a very powerful class and the only reason that we're in u6 right now as opposed to like the higher uh, Uber portals is just because I really don't have good gear with him on PTS because I don't main the candy barb at all But I mean look at that we're, we're still wrecking things like super duper easy and e e Like that's the thing too is it's like pretty much all the classes ended up getting some major buffs anyway So you don't really have to worry, but either way. Thanks for watching everybody. That's gonna be it Do not forget to hook in the like button share favorite and subscribe to join Team Big So sign on and stay epic everybody